day of honoring the men and women who serve our country is wrapping up in Western New York put on a number of events today to celebrate Veterans Day. Some even braving the elements outside earlier in the day. And as we honor veterans, we're also learning more about a Buffalo man who made the ultimate sacrifice. His family is working to learn more about their fallen soldier 80 years later. Cecil Wolf enlisted in the U.S. Army during World War II and had the rank of private. His family says he had served in the Philippines for two years. The last time his family heard from him was the day before the Pearl Harbor attacks on December 7th, 1941. He was supposed to come home the following January, but was later declared missing in action about six months later. His family has yet to find his remains, but his great great niece is working to bring him home. From there, like that's where the mystery really began. My uh, my grandfather actually spent, I think, 495 days over in the Philippines looking for his brother. And um, so it's been this like <laughs> generations of people searching for him. Um, but I mean, slowly we're starting to get some things like the awards and, you know, what unit. Wolf's family members were able to memorialize him at Forest Lawn Cemetery this past August. He was posthumously awarded 14 medals of honor, including the Purple Heart.